so hey you guys and welcome back to my youtube channel um so today we're giving wash and go um using my new products from curls i did try to record this wash and go look for y'all in the past but somehow the video didn't record i'm lying i know how it's because i didn't um i didn't update my storage um so the videos didn't record um in that section i did like a wash and go with a braid out but today since i'm kind of about to go somewhere in like four minutes i need to leave um i decided to do it again and instead just do a wash and go since um i can just go with my hair <laughs> literally wash and go <laughs> Um, I also did my makeup, um, which will be in another video, um, but let's get into this wash and go real quick. y'all this wash and go real quick um this is a full wash day routine with the go after it because i needed to get out the house but anyways y'all can see how crazy my head looked before um i actually washed it and did the wash and go just like y'all saw with the thumbnail a before and the after and anyways i'm just you know fluffing it out and we gonna start by getting it wet. And yes, I'm showing y'all that my underarms are actually waxed this time. Period. But anyways, um, we're gonna start just by getting our hair wet. Getting the hair wet. Um, while you're getting it wet, you wanna just be like, kinda pulling it apart and making sure that the water is getting on all the strands. Your hair needs to be completely saturated for this part. And that's exactly what you see me doing here. So with my hair soaking wet, I am taking this Blueberry Bliss Reparative Hair Wash or Blueberry Bliss reparative wash by curls i'm just reading the instructions and i'm gonna go into the roots the first time that i'm applying this because i am gonna apply this two times to my scalp i'm gonna apply it the first time to my scalp and massage it in and then i'm gonna also apply it all over and detangle with it in so keep watching now y'all will see exactly what i'm talking about <laughs> while it's in the scalp you just scrub it up dub scrub it up dub and then i'm using this uh head massager that i got with my joyful bee kit and I'm using that to also help with massaging. That way if my fingers get tired, I'm all good because I got this as a backup. But I'm using it to massage it a little bit more into the scalp before I'll rinse it out and reapply some more of that same Blueberry Bliss Reparative Hair Wash. So 
So it's the same thing again. I'm going back in, but this time I'm rubbing it all over my wet hair. And then I'm gonna be using my wide tooth comb to detangle. And then after I use my wide tooth comb to de detangle, I'm also gonna go back over it with my brush from my Joyful Bee Kit. Now, one thing I do wanna say is like, I sectioned my hair while I was detangling it. So what I did, since I didn't really have any clips, um, I parted it into four sections and I just braid it out after I'm done with each section. Um, and that's what I'll use for the sections moving forward, the braids. So I'll untangle the braid when I'm rinsing it out and then I'll rebraid it um, to keep it out of the way and I'll keep doing it, so on and so forth.
So once I'm done sectioning and detangling with the reparative hair wash in my hair, and life is good, I'm lit, period. Um, I am going to leave this on my hair for 10 minutes. This is how much dead hair I had. Um, I'm going to be leaving this on my hair for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, I'm going to come back. I'm going to rinse it out, and then I'm going to apply the hair mask. So as y'all see, I am rinsing my hair out in segments to make sure that it's nice and properly rinsed. I am not braiding it all the way down because I know very soon after I'm going to have to take these braids out again in sections and apply the reparative, the Blueberry Bliss reparative hair mask. So I'm just doing it in smaller, like braiding it down so it's not getting mixed into the other sections, but also like it's still its own section if you if y'all get what i'm saying <laughs> So now we taking that Blueberry Bliss reparative hair mask. We are getting some in there. We're working it all the way in. And then we're gonna go back in and detangle with a wide tooth comb. I'm, a, I'm also gonna use my massager for a little bit of razzle dazzle, you feel me? Um, once I'm done, I'm just going to go ahead and braid the section back up because I will be deep conditioning with my hair in these um, braids. So once I'm essentially going to do the same thing for all of the rest of the segments, which is applying the Blueberry Bliss Repairative Hair Mask, detangling and massaging, and then braiding it back up. So... It's the same thing that I just explained, so I'm just going to repeat that process, and then I'm going to deep condition my hair for 25 minutes. So keep watching, and I'll be back. Thank you. 
So once this braid is done, I am going to apply a plastic cap over my head. It's one that's really, really stretched out because it's kind of old, but it works nonetheless. So I'm going to be using it. I'm going to be tucking everything under that when I um, go to add my hot head. So I'll leave this on for 25 minutes. I am going to microwave my hot head um, and put it on my head for 25 minutes. This is after it had been already 25 minutes. I microwaved the hot head. I did 30 second, 30 second intervals and I kept flipping it inside and out between each 30 seconds. Um, and then I left it on my head for 25 minutes to let it deep condition. Um, and now I'm back to rinse it out. So I'm going to rinse it out in sections like I did before. And then, yeah. The deep conditioning is done and essentially most of the hair wash itself is done y'all can see the curls are already forming the curls are already coming in and this is only just the washing part of this entire routine we ain't even get to styling it <laughs> so i just want to keep them in braids because i am going to go back through and style them and i kind of want to keep them wet for the style but i just keep them braided up i'm gonna take a shower um and then i'm gonna keep it wet throughout my shower and then i'm gonna come back and style it okay so now i'm back i am using it um i'm using the leave-in conditioner um it's the same from the same line it's the blueberry bliss uh leave-in conditioner i am going to be applying it in sections massaging it into my scalp and then working it through the ends as well um i am going to do this entire hair in segments so i'll do the first segment um with everything that i'm going to be adding into my hair for the styling as well and then i'll be done so i'm going to go in with this curl control jelly after the leave-in conditioner I'm gonna rub that up into my hair. I'm going to scrunch it up and then I'm gonna kind of leave it to air dry. It's the same process for all the other segments, um, the, all the other sections. So reparative, uh, the leave-in conditioner, after the leave-in conditioner, you add the curl control jelly, you scrunch it up and you let them curls just come in and form, baby. And you see how they're coming in pretty nice already and I haven't really scrunched it up as much. Um, 
and they'll definitely look more fuller and bigger once they're done and then you can um, really style it to your liking as well. this is my hair once all of the sections are done um i don't know whether i'm going to be doing a middle side or whatever part as of yet so so now i'm out the shower i did my skincare i'm done getting dressed i'm just adding some oil my hair has started to dry for a little bit but i'll be using the blueberry bliss um hair oil um i'm just gonna put this um headband around my head because i will be doing my makeup right now Once I finished with my face, I just went back in with that Blueberry Bliss. Um, I think it's control paste. Um, it's literally just like an edge control like I, um, I'll tell y'all in the video, my other video. I couldn't find my edge brush, so I just used my regular hairbrush, and that's the finished look, y'all. So, y'all, after doing everything, I did my little hair um, using this control paste. Um... And this is the final look. I'm really loving my hair. I don't usually wear my hair out that much. Um, I'm loving my hair. I'm loving how the final look came together. Um, so thank you, Marla, for suggesting this. And I look forward to seeing you guys in my next video. Bye.